Now, Daisy, I don't know if you've ever been involved in this train wreck of a radio segment. I don't know if you've ever listened to it. Um, but it's it's on its last legs to the point where today could well be the last time it runs around. Well, hopefully I have something to do with that and can take it down one last time. Oh, I yeah. ruined the footy show. I was on the last one of that, and hopefully I can ruin this. Yes, oh. you did too. <laughs> you, you, you might go very close. Now, what happens is people ring. Yep. Uh, Bill says hello. You're not allowed to say hello back. You just tell us what you're doing on a beautiful Saturday afternoon here in Melbourne, <laughs> and then you get on with answering the questions. I do indeed, and thanks to IGA Liquor, we have a voucher for them, and this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Hello there. <laughs> what accent was what? that? That's just a little uh, thing. Now, Jase, where do you reckon we're going here? <laughs> oh. Glenn. <laughs> well, have the a hell? look at the board, Jim. Oh, Where am I supposed to go? I haven't even started yet. Well, Chris from Australia, is he? Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Chris from Australia. Oh, let's go with Glenn in Geelong. Just read the paper, Bill. Oh, what paper? The, the Addy? Uh, no, no, the Herald Sun. Fair enough. Righto, here we go, Glenny boy. Who do Richmond play in next week's prelim final? Uh, Port Adelaide. Well done. Nice, Glenn. Can you name Collingwood's last premiership captain, Glenn? Um, uh, Nick. Um, oh, I know him. Nick. Uh, he was a number five, Guernsey. Um, yes. Nick. No. Uh, oh, come on, Leroy. Yeah. Two. Oh, yeah, long you going to leave him hanging, it Leroy. Was, it was on the end of his tongue. Never Thank call you, us Glenn. again, please. Everyone knows Bad it. luck, Glenn. Oh, no. Uh, Jason's there in Diamond Creek. Beautiful, that part of the world, Jim. Oh, yeah. Just put a few bets on the races. You got a winner for us today? Oh, no, nah, mate. Not much of fun. Oh, all right. <laughs> well, what, why are you putting bets on the races then, mate? <laughs> you you got to get lucky one day, don't you? You do. Uh, can you name Collingwood's last premiership captain there, Nick? Jason? Uh, Nick, oh. Nick <laughs> oh, no. I don't what is wrong with you? Is it usually this bad? Oh, Nick, oh, is it no. usually this bad? Surely not. <laughs> Number three is... <laughs> I get no help. I get no help whatsoever. This is what is Leroy doing? It gets. Can you turn the radio off or something, Jace? Have you got it on? Don't. No, oh, that's. Oh, right. Huh? <laughs> now you've got um, you got uh, different rooms. Brian, who's up there in the Gold Coast. You got Chubbles, Daisy, and Cheetah Duck. Okay, number three. In 1989. How many goals did Gary Ablett kick in his last three finals? The semi, the prelim, the grand final. Was it A, 18? Was it B, 20? Was it C, 22 or D, 24? I uh, got... might go with Duck on me. Uh, all right, uh, Cheetah. Okay. Uh, for memory. Oh, no. a panic of Duck. <laughs> No, the reason, the reason why I remember... Because it's written out in front of you? The reason why I remember oh, geez. is because yeah. it was 7, 8 and 9, which equals 24, so I'm pretty sure it's... You pretty, sure? It was that many? I'm, yeah, 24, I reckon. You reckon D, 24? What do you reckon, uh, Jase? What were the options again? Oh, oh A eighteen, B twenty, C twenty two, or D twenty four. Duck went with twenty four. Yeah, we'll go. We'll go with twenty four then. Oh, what a <laughs> twenty four goals in three games. It's good going. I think I got about six or seven. So we kicked thirty between I don't, I don't us. I reckon you would. Well, yeah, thirty between us. Well done. <laughs> well done, Billy and Gaz. Number four in the two thousand and five semi final between Sydney and Geelong. How many goals did Nick Bloody Davis kick in the last quarter? Jace? Three. Oh, bad luck, Jace. That was, you know, oh, Dave's there in Nary Warren. Hey, Dave. Having a beer, eating lunch. So what's for lunch? Multigrain roll, salami and cheese, and a nice Bojack brewing local local craft beer. It's a nice lunch. Nice. That's really nice extravagant one. from a boy from Nary Warren. Exactly. It's like <laughs> our man Ryan Warren from Nary Warren. Nary Warren. Mm, yep. <laughs> that's, that's oh, we've, got, we've got a bit of class here, Bill. No, not really. Yeah, not, 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 not attached to Ryan Warren there, isn't it? <laughs> no, Ryan Warren, our producer, Rugby. he's from Nary Warren. Mm. And his dad's name's <laughs> Greg. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Dave, oh, no. Dave. <laughs> <In t> <laughs> he, he was a nude centerfold one day. <laughs> that, 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 Get on <laughs> with the <laughs> quiz. <laughs> there ain't no fat. <laughs> Can you be a nude fight? <laughs> Nary Warren, I star. I question. 
Um, so have I. <laughs> oh, Nick Davis, how many goals he kick in the final quarter when the Sydney side got over the Cats? That'd be five. No, it wasn't five either. Uh, Vinny's there. G'day, Vinny. Yep, I'm good. <laughs> Vin. Vinny, what are you doing? No, I know. Oh, oh, I took oh, the dog I'm... for a walk and now I'm just sitting around doing stuff all. What sort of dog? How much does it cost you? <laughs> <laughs> He's a beagle, and I reckon he cost about uh, about a thousand bucks. More than that. Yeah. Did your missus buy it and say she, it only cost a thousand? Oh no, I wish she bought it for me, but no. Oh right. Okay. <laughs> Good to talk to you, Vin. How many goals did Nick Davis kick in the final quarter against the Cats back in two thousand and five? He kicked four. He did, and won the game. From remember mm, that Cameron yeah. Mooney in tears. He seems to be in tears a lot. <laughs> Even his wedding at the wedding. Brian and I were calling that game with the great Sam Newman bristle, and when he kicked the third of those fourth goal, Sam took the earphones yeah, off, and threw we'll... them against the glass, and refused to speak. <laughs> <laughs> so we did the rest of the game yeah. with no special comments because the four snatched it. But like Ron Brassie, who oh, well, dropped no, his pen. He was trying to find his pen. <laughs> when when uh, Yatesy ran through the... <laughs> Rex Hunt's cross to him. And one of the biggest bumps you'll ever see in grand final history. The best in the business. Ron Brassy, what happened? I dropped me hand, Rex. <laughs> <and I'm like laughs> <laughs> Did that really happen? Well, I don't know. You have to ask the force because, again, he <laughs> tells the story. It's, it's, uh, That'll be Bill's hands. story by the end of next week. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I'm going to use that. It's like on polish polish it up, Bill. Tuck it away. Be a ripper for you. <laughs> When I was on K-Rock. <laughs> with, with Ron Barassi. <laughs> <laughs> Number five, we're up to. <laughs> oh, Leroy, better. Since, now have a think about this, Vinny. Since 1980, seven players have kicked their 100th goal in a final. Can you name five? Ducks out, you've got uh, Old Chubbles, Daisy, and uh, different rooms, Brian. It says, can, uh, you, can you name I reckon uh, I'll go with Daisy on this one. Oh, Daisy. <laughs> it says name six, Bill, in the question. Well, it's a bit hard, I thought. I'm just taking some ownership of the quiz. <laughs> right. Five. No, name five. Seven players have kicked their 100th goal in the final days. And without cheating, please. Oh, well, um, I'm not the uh, oldest member of this team, so it's been a while ago. I know one of them was Kappa, my boy, the Wiz. Um, Matty Lloyd. Lord, I'm one oh, of not sure. I'm not yeah. sure. Um... From memory, the big G train, because that halted all the momentum in that yeah, final against Port Adelaide. Jim, yeah. Jim's, mate. Uh, um, my mate Garrett. He is or, my mate. I'm thinking back potentially to five years before I was born. I've just got an oh. inkling that maybe <laughs> Blight kicked. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't even know who Malcolm Blight is. He kicked the biggest talk you'll ever see at Princess Park, William. But that wasn't in a final. No, it wasn't, and it wasn't for his 100th goal, but it was one of them. And... Uh, what about big Summer, Sumich? Oh, Is that five? Who? Yeah. Uh, that might be. Right. Yep. Blight, Sumich, Lloyd, Garrick and Kappa. Not sure if they're all right. Vin, what do you think? Um, yeah, I mean, I'll back Daisy in. I'll yeah. see how we go. I love the confidence. I wouldn't be so... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, pretty boy. oh, no! Oh, Bill. Not an ad. Yeah. I'm on fire! What's the five questions? I'm on fire, Jim. Oh, seriously. Welcome back. Don't go anywhere. Just have a cup of tea, and we'll be back after this. All right, now, Fat, yep. you've got ten minutes okay. to complete this quiz. Well, so get on with it. As long as everyone else does their jobs, Leroy. And... No padding or any stupid oh, questions. Nah. Just get on with it. <laughs> Welcome back, Vin. Hello, guys. What have you been doing? Oh, just uh, sitting around, still doing stuff all. Right, we're up to number six in this magnificent quiz, thanks to the IGA Liquor Gym. Mm -hmm. uh, Joel Selwood plays his 32nd final to sit outright third for the most number of finals played. Which two players sit above him? Ooh, I reckon Sean Burgoyne and Michael Tuck. Ooh, well done. Easy, seven, nice. look at that. Oh. And number seven, Daisy Thomas. Oh, yes. He's... Put on a touch. Was dropped. <laughs> was dropped from the blue side last year for having how many red wines 48 hours before a game? How many red wines did he have? Vin? Oh, um, I'll say oh, three. Daisy, what was the answer? Yeah, I said three or four. How many did you really have? Well, I had three or four glasses. Just each one was filled up five or six times. <laughs> <laughs> didn't lie. No, exactly. Free well done and well done to you, Vin. This is number eight, which is a... Get a room, Vin! 
Last line, and we've only got Brian left, who's doing his puzzle <laughs> up there. He's always last. Well, we've talked about it before. <laughs> the schoolyard. <laughs> <laughs> which one of the following coaches? Which one of the following coaches has coached the most number of finals with 43, Vin and Brian? Is it A, Kevin Sheedy, B, Tom Hafey, C, Alan Jeans, or D, Ron Barassi? Super coaches there. Wow. Vin, what are you thinking? Do you want to use uh, Brian? Yeah, may as well give Brian a whirl. Right, hey, Brian. What was the question again, Bill? Oh, don't ask no, <laughs> Brian. <laughs> Seriously. Most, was it most number of games? Most number of finals, Brian. Are you listening? Okay, which coach? <laughs> A, and Kevin who, Sheedy, who, B, who, Tom Hafey, yeah. C, Alan Yabby Jeans, or Ron Dale Brassy, D. Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, okay. This I think is... we can rule out Jeansy. Oh, you sure? I think, well, I think because he had someone before him and someone after him, so... Maybe not. Um, the rest of them probably did too. <laughs> yeah. I reckon Cheese has, I reckon Hafey has, I reckon Brassy has. Yeah, but in the in the peak trough period, I meant. Peak trough. Um, <laughs> peak trough. It's either Brass- the peak or the trough, Brian. Okay, rule out Brassy. Brassy's out. Um, geez, Hafey coached a lot of finals at Collingwood, did, but it's only yeah. a short a lot, period. A lot. Sheedy coached quite a few as well. Geez, it's a tough question, Bill. Well, that's why I'm asking, and that's why they're asking you, Brian. Look, I'd be almost positive, though, yeah. uh, out of th- even though it is a really, really tough question. I'm, I'm like 99% Kevin Sheedy for sure. Kevin Sheedy. What do you think, yeah. Min? Yeah, sure, we'll go with uh, Brian. He seems pretty confident. Oh, oh Brian. Brian. So there Kevin Sheedy uh, ha- uh, with 43, mm-hmm. Hafey 42, Jeans 41, oh. Brassy mm-hmm. 33. I. Number nine, you're getting there for the IGA Liquor. Voucher, which team did Geelong defeat in last year's semi-final at the MCG, the Gabba, the Wacker? It doesn't really matter this summer. It was West Coast, I believe. Oh, Vin. Has he got the answers too like that? Oh, he's no. doing very This nicely. is it, Jim. Which, when? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Which, when? <laughs> when? <laughs> when Collingwood... <laughs> when Collingwood... <laughs> Shut up! When Collingwood played Geelong back in round seven, which, which, <laughs> when, which when man, Collingwood. Collingwood player kicked five? Sorry, what was that? Which Collingwood player what? <laughs> what was the question, Bill? <laughs> Christ's sake. Which Collingwood played Geelong back in round seven when Collingwood player kicked five goals? Oh, that's not a question. <laughs> what is that question, Bill? <laughs> which which the Collingwood player Could kicked five goals? Could we get it in English? <laughs> Bill asked it properly. <laughs> when Collingwood played Geelong back in round seven this year, Vin, which <laughs> Collingwood player kicked five? Not hard, Vin. Uh, I'll say Jordan DeGoey. Yes! Bang! 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 IGA Liquor voucher out to you, my friend. Proudly independent they are, Jim. Favourite beer, wine, spirits, whatever you want. Yeah, they've got your final series covered. Head in store and pick up your favourite beer, wine and spirits from IGA Liquor Vin. Well done to you. And uh, I think, Daisy, you've just had a first-hand view of, of why I have been trying to eliminate this quiz from our station. Oh, for good reason. It's amazing, that level. It's amazing how one uh, one word can change a sentence. <laughs> or both start. Just when you don't say the right oh, word, though, when it's well, written in front of you. They both it's incredible. With W. <laughs> that just sums up Bill's career, not being able to find the right word. Which or when? Now, that's pretty much it, I think, for us. Good show. I've no, been good. You've been really poor. <laughs> I've been good again. Jim. Bill, if we had a best and fairest, like we give three two ones, no, I'd get a lot of twos. You didn't get anywhere near enough sleep <laughs> for a start. A... <laughs> I, you'd only just got in when you turned up this morning, no, I... <laughs> and, and and I would question whether you're actually in a fit state to perform. I I, I get, don't think you were. I get a lot of twos, better than and, Brian. I'll grump it up things, there. And things are going to change in your household in the next week or two as well, Bill. You're going to have to be really on the ball. Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> going to become a father. <laughs> oh, well, not again. For the first time. <laughs> uh, Duck, good seeing you. Yes, no, all good. Who, uh, who wins tonight? I know Fat's going to say Geelong. Yeah, uh, I'm going to stick with the Cats. I think that uh, they've been a good team all year. A little bit of a hiccup last week. They'll bounce back. Days? Uh, the Pies are win tonight. All right, and nice thing. you. Yeah. Very nice. No, very good. Work. Today was one grand right. final. Beautifully Wasn't done. Wasn't awarded a medal, but I bought one in anyway. Oh, he's got oh, the premiership medal. Look at the premiership oh, medal. What a flog. What are we dealing with?
He's a flow. He's got yeah, the premiership medal. Yeah. We've got another duck. <laughs> Kip. Great seeing you, Bristol. Enjoy uh, the rest of the week in quarantine. Oh. <laughs>